Alright, so I just bought this. I have no idea how to play this. I've never played. There's so much fucking information, but <coughs> I've been. Uh, this is my little my first playthrough. I've been tinkering tinkering around with the lines. I uh, took over the Red Wings. I uh, kept as Stevie Y as the GM. I made him also the coach, so I could do all this shit. <coughs> but yeah, so it's. I don't know, it's kind of weird. I thought they would just, like, get rid of Zetterberg and, where is he, Franzen, because, you know, they're pretty much retired, but I guess technically they're on the contract for books or whatever. But, they're still there. You can't play them because they're injured. Uh, so I kind of just did what I think would be good. Like, uh, yeah, Larkin, he's like a playmaker. I, I adjusted some stats for these players, like... I'm not sure if this means like that I'm they're using my my adjustment if I check this box. I think that's what it means, so hopefully I didn't fuck that up. Uh a couple things I was kinda I was kinda disappointed that they made uh Fabry oh fuck. Where is he at? So they got him only at like capped out as a two, which I thought was kinda weird because he's twenty three. Uh I think he was a was he a former first rounder? Yeah. Former first round pick back in 2014, and he's kind of just had injuries. And ever since he's coming over the Red Wings, he's been killing it. So, I mean, I guess they didn't really know uh, that he was going to start doing good, but it's kind of crazy that he's stuck at two. Like, he's at 1.5, and then he can only go up to two. So that kind of sucks. Probably going to have to move on from him in the future. But. Right now, we are probably going to be really, really fucking shitty because Franz Nielsen is stuck on the books for how many more years? Fuck, where's he at? Alphabet. There we go. Nielsen. Uh, I just want to look at his shit. Can I look at his contract? There we go. Contract. He's got three years left as a... I mean, I have him on the second line, but honestly, like... He should probably be a third liner. 2.5. I mean, they kind of give him a decent rating, but he's a good solid two-way guy. He shouldn't be a second liner. He's getting paid second line money, though. Uh, I got Flipper. Rosie, I'm surprised they gave... Ugh. I wish I could just click on him and not do that. But, uh, where's... Let me go by name. Rosie. They got they gave him pretty good stats for, I mean he's only played like a total of, what like. Does it tell you? Red Wing, yeah he played like ten games and yeah he put up you know seven points but still like, he's undrafted and all that and but they're giving him, pretty good rating right off the bat. Like his passing and puck handling is really good. Maybe I should put him on a shootout. I don't really understand these stats too much yet. Well, shot block, so yeah, he's not very defensive. He can't hit, can't check. Face off, he's not terrible. Pretty decent positioning for defensive wise. Not the greatest stick check or defensive read. Not fast, but he's not slow. He's agile. Well, he's professional, and he doesn't have a shot, a hot temper. That's nice. Team player, not very aggressive. Shooting range is meh. So yeah, he's pretty good offensively. I put him as a playmaker, I think. Yeah. But our team is probably gonna be shitty. I offered a couple trades. I don't know if they like went through or not, or like if I have to simulate a day. But uh, how do I fucking do this? Home. Um. Uh, like nothing tells me that I offered a trade and I kind of didn't even realize but um fuck where's like not stats where's finances alright team finances I completely forgot to pay attention to this but we only got like 3 mil for like free agents 
and I offered like three trades. Uh, one was, what was it? I think I was trying to get rid of a prospect that we actually did get rid of. Was it Kasky? I think I got, I, I offered Kasky for, was it Eric Comrie, I think? Yeah, on the Coyotes, I offered it. Uh, yeah, I wanted Comrie because, like, that actually happened, except we traded, what's his name? Well, I can't even say it. It's like, yeah, Sarah Harvey. I don't know how to say that, but I thought I had traded. I mean, Kasky got traded earlier for some dude and what, Kyle Wood or something, but I wasn't paying. I haven't paid attention too much to the Red Wings. But I tried to get Comrie because I was like, eh, let's see what happens. And then I realized my whole cap problem. And I was like, well, let me try to get rid of Bernier. I think I offered her a, I think I offered Bernier to the Coyotes for a fourth just because it says they need a goalie. And then it said that it should go through. And then the other person I traded for was, I think he was on the uh, trading block. Where is that at? I don't remember how I got to that. Was it, um, where's the trade block? Manager, Red Wings, transactions, upcoming. God, there's so much, so many tabs. I can't, was it on transaction? No. Man, where was it? Uh, home. Manager options? No. Jesus, this is gonna annoy me. Let's just. Oh my gosh! All right, not world. News? No, not news. <laughs> this is like all right, and it should be on NHL transactions. Oops. Oh yeah, trading block. So yeah, I just sorted this just to see who was available. I saw Dougie Hamilton was available. I was like, oh man, like that'd be nice to have because we got Bowie on like our bottom th three and we're probably going to move on from Mike Green because he's at the last year of his deal and I don't really want to resign him. He's pretty old. So I was like, Dougie Hamilton, fucking three star already. He could grow a little bit. He'd be a solid top four guy. Maybe even, I mean, he's going to be on the top line for us if we get him. But I offered, what did I offer? I think I offered a second round pick and Bowie. Just got rid of, try to get rid of Bowie. And then I was like, oh shit, like he's got, what is it, six mil? 5.75 or something? Uh, 5.75 for the next two years. I think next year it's six. Uh, it just says six over there. I don't know. But yeah, so I offered all that. And I don't know if it went through or not. It didn't give me like any, it just kind of just went back to like the main screen. And I was like... I hope it went through, but I guess we'll just advance. I mean, I got my lineup set now. So here's the lineups. Got Birdie, Larkin, Mantha, Double A, Nielsen. I would have put, I feel like Philippa should be better, but he's not. He's a lower rating. They're about the same type of player. So I put Fli uh, Flipper on the third line instead. And I got Perlini, which he actually can grow. Uh, where is it? He can grow. Ah, I can't. These lists are so hard to find. Okay, there's Perlini. He can grow, like, up to 2.5, which I felt like is pretty decent. I feel like that's pretty accurate, except it's kind of funny because Fabry's playing, like, really good, and Perlini's not really playing that great. And then they have Fabry, like, blocked at, well, like, a 2, I think. And he's worse right now, also. You got like what Fabry's a 1.5, and then you got Perlini as a two. I was like, oh, okay. Rossi, hopefully he can grow. I know he can go to the two and a half, or was it a three? He is a two and a half. I think he can go to a three. Uh, Ernie, I put him as an agitator. He's just kind of there on the fourth line. Glenny, I'm gonna try to keep him as like our fourth line center for hopefully his entire career, and then Helm. Hopefully we can get rid of his contract soon i think like all these players like no trade clause so it's i can't get rid of nielsen 
I can't get rid of Helm. I can't get rid of Applicator. I'm not even playing Applicator. I mean, he's a two-star. I probably could play him somewhere, but I'm not going to just because I don't. <laughs> he, he got such a crazy deal for what he put up. And now we're stuck with him for like I think what four more years, at like four point two five. Yeah, four. It's gonna that's gonna suck. But I wanted to see if I could make the Red Wings decent, which I doubt I will because this team, there's so many contract problems because of fucking Ken Holland. Uh, anyways, defense. I got the Kaiser at top. Honestly, like a lot of people say, the Kaiser's contract is stupid. Yeah, he's only two star in here, but honestly, I feel like his contract's not awful. Five was it five mil? Five mil for three more years. That's not terrible. Defenseman, like I mean, he probably should be getting like maybe like three point five or four. Probably like four mil. I would say on like a short. He should have had a shorter deal when they gave it to him, but whatever. Uh, Heronic, he's probably gonna like stay with us for. He's part of like the rebuild. He's gonna stay with us for a while. I'm hoping to keep him as like a. Maybe he could play top line for a while, and then maybe we can get some better guys, and he'll be on the top four, and then power play. And then Green, he's gonna be gone. Hopefully, Nemeth, he's probably gonna be gone eventually. Chalowski, I'm or Chalowski. Chalowski, I'm hoping to grow. I think he can actually get, like, he's our future, hopefully. Yeah, four-star. Hopefully he can grow and go to the top line. I don't know how the, uh, like, grow, like, how to grow your players, like, how to do it in this game. I'm not sure if there's some tactic or if there's something you have to do. By the way, hopefully he's gone. Uh, do we have any other defensemen that I'm trying to get rid of? Bega, he's just, like, a scratch player. I think daily he's gonna be gone. Uh, yeah, we got Howard and Bernier. Howard's gonna be gone after this year. Bernier, I'm trying to get rid of. Um, I went to training. I have no idea what like how this works. I uh, what did I? I sorted it? I think by players under 29. And I like sorted by potential. And then I just, I did physical for almost all of them. And then it started to drop to 18. So I was like, all right, I'll see, I'll just leave it there then. And then this one, I only got like three of them. Then it dropped to 18. And I did, yeah, Chronic, I want to get in more physical. And like, I'm not sure, like these ones, like FNCU, he's already like at his potential is what it's saying. But like, if I train him, will he get better? I, I don't know. And same with like, I think Bertuzzi. Uh, I got, I'm like trying to train him an offensive and I'm not sure if he's going to get better, but I don't know if like I have to do anything else. If I have to, if I just leave it and like, as I simulate, like they're going to try to grow them in these spots. Tina. So it's like, do I want this number to be higher than what they already have? Or is this just like what I'm allowed? Like, so I can only go up to a certain amount. Like if I, is it going to focus more on them? Wait. Why is that giving 20? What does this X mean? Let's see. This level of competition is limiting the player's development. Is he, like, too good? for? No, he's not good enough, I'm guessing, because he's one star, one star. Yeah, they're all, like, lower rated. Hmm. That's weird. Oh, for goalies, like, it resets the... You can do the other stuff, too. Oh, no, you get... Mental, yeah, they have mental and goalie. Okay, that's so weird. But Calvin McCarty, you're stuck there. Sorry. Um, God, like I kind of wish, like when I opened this up first, it would tell me a little bit about what. Like they kind of tell you if you go over it. Oh, there's extra coaching attention on improving the number. Oh, there it is. The number in parentheses indicates the amount of help given to the player. The more players selected in this category, the lower the number will be for each. So it doesn't matter if it's over. That's just the amount of help they're going to get. Okay. So I could do more players, I guess. Like this Lidstrom guy, he can get some. Um, Sahar, I'm f yeah, I didn't try trading. I'm trying trading Kasky. So we'll Kuffner, I like these guys I don't really care about. They're not going to really grow that much. Uh, okay. And then so, yeah, let's just do like everybody that I want to be on the team in the future 
I'm not sure about N, if I'm going to keep him or not. I feel like he's a good fourth liner, but... Oh, it's two and a half stars. I guess he could play alongside Glennie on the fourth line. So we'll get his mental, like... Mental, physical, and defensive training for him. Hicketts, he can be mental, physical... I just want everything for Hicketts. I kind of just want to see him do good. <laughs> <clears throat> Giovanni Smith, physical definitely, uh, mental yeah, offensive. I'm not too worried about him offensively because he's supposed to. Be, I mean, he's supposed to be like fourth liner. But they're both left wingers. Uh, maybe we'll trade one in the future. But yeah, let's get him defensive. And then Lindstrom, he's a defenseman, so obviously defenseman. Okay, I wish I could look at their ratings from here. I have to go to a different screen to do that. It's kind of stupid. Um, well, I guess I see his stats. He looks like he's more of a defensive defenseman. Only six points, yeah. I mean, I don't know what type of comp... Like, he's only a one-star, though, and that competition level could have been... I don't know too much about the SHL. So, offensive... He's pretty weak off... I mean, he's pretty well-balanced, but... Let's just... Yeah, let's just do defensive... Let's get offensive, too, for him. But we don't have to worry about physical form for right now. Rasmussen. I think I want everything Rasmussen. Uh, Cider. We already got everything. Everything. And, yeah, let's just do everything for him, too. Because these are, like, our main prospects. So now, uh, let's go to Toledo now. Let's see what we got there. So, like, nobody... <laughs> Couple two stars, uh, probably nothing. What's the U stand for then? Unhappy. Okay, so competition is X, and then U is like happiness if they're unhappy. Uh, what about goalies? What do we got for goalies down here? Mm, give it one and a half star. Like, <laughs> unreal. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm really worried too much about Toledo. I mean, we, get, we got a couple two-stars that we could maybe bring up, but for what? Like, the AHL, I guess. Let's just see. Yeah, they they do get... Let's just give it to them. Let's just see. You guys are going to get so much attention down here. Oh, they're not goalies, obviously. Um. Yeah, these guys I don't really care about. Let's just give it to these two because they make them two stars. And they're lefty defensemen. Like, who knows? Uh, let's go back to Detroit. Alright, so now that I know that, I want to give, like, everybody time, pretty much. They're t I mean, let's just, yeah, let's just leave it. Yeah, I think that's fine. It'll only go up, like, by one. Yeah, okay. Alright, so that's training. Scouting, I don't think I can scout yet. I think that's, they're just like, stuck. I don't know what to do on this screen. So it just says no assignment. Uh, info. Cool. I don't know. <laughs> Scouting Central Agency. Is this like the upcoming draft? Yeah. I don't know how to say his name. I've heard, this is the only prospect I like have heard of. Lef Lefrenier. Lef Lafreniere, Laf let me Google this shit. I'm not Lafreniere. Oh, Lafreniere. Yeah, I think he's supposed to be like the number one pick overall this upcoming draft. I haven't heard too much about anyone else. I don't really pay attention too much to the draft until like after it happens, and then I'll find out like who is the main, who was the most coveted pick or was supposed to get picked like I remember what was it like two years ago when they drafted Valino the Red Wings uh he was projected to go like or like not early but like a little bit after the top 10 in the first round and he dropped all the way to like 30th and we picked him up there which was kind of sa same with like Zadina I think he was supposed to go like number three and we got him at six I want to say but yeah so like here's my tactics 
I'm not sure like how to match the lines. Like I get, yeah, first line they go out. Like if they wanted it to be like first line goes out with fourth line, but I don't know. I feel like the first line's kind of like pretty good, so they should go against. I guess like third line would be like desirable, third and fourth. But then like these guys are bad, and then we're gonna have them out against like the top lines. So I I don't. I felt like this was a good balance, maybe. Maybe we'll do like second and third, and then third line will take the first and fourth line. No, uh, fourth line can take the third. Yeah, how I had it. So like, yeah, yeah, face off priority. Yeah, so defensive zone, I put third, and then first, and then fourth. Yeah, second. You get what's going on there. I didn't understand this too much. So, I mean, I get, like, yeah, pull your goalie down by a goal, like, normal. Like, so does that mean, like, a normal amount of time remaining, you pull out the goalie? Uh, so the maximum number of seconds remaining in the game before you will attempt to pull your goalie for an extra. Why don't they just put it by time, then? Why wouldn't they just put, like, two minutes left or, or like, a minute and a half left? You pull out your goalie if you're down by one. Like, normal doesn't tell me when they're going to pull, I guess, probably like two minutes minute and a half that's probably like the average i'd say down by two so if i have it at fast does it mean they pull them earlier pull goalie down by two specifies the maximum number of seconds remaining in the game before you will attempt to pull your goalie for an extra while down by two. so i'm gonna assume fast means you pull them sooner and then goalie switch is that like if your goalie is being shitty all right, yeah, goalie will be pulled if he gives up. So yeah, several goals early. Yeah. So I think I yeah I'll leave that on normal. Yeah, normal is fine with that. Basic. Uh, I guess my tactics. I'm pretty much like just middle for mostly everything. I'm not sh like I'm not too familiar with tactics. Like I understand like yeah, two three press. You got two forwards up pressing. So like I kind of know some of these. I've never really like actually like ran some of this stuff. Uh, yeah, keep the players wide. And I like how it tells you like oh best use with wingers with good speed and stick. Like it kind of helps you a little bit. And then they got the unit ones. I didn't really mess with these ones. I messed with the first line. I think I like was gonna start messing with these, but I don't really know what to do, like what I should give for these players. Like I know like Bertuzzi, Larkin, and Mansa, they were gonna be mostly offensive. So I put like attacking aggr I kinda kept it in the middle. I messed with these I think a little bit. No, I don't know if I messed with these actually at all. Because I don't want them dumping in. Funnel. Yeah, I guess funnel would be fine. Pretty sure they all have good puck handling except for Tuzi. Can I look at their stats from here? Oh, I can. Cool. So yeah, puck handling like Mantha, pretty good. I feel like there's too many. Sh like I, I wish this button was bigger too, just so I could go back and forth between it more easily. So yeah, puck handling. Like, I uh, I think Bertuzzi is more of just like a two-way kind of, and he's not really gonna grow. Oh, he's got pretty good. He's actually got pretty good offensive stats for being, what is he, like a three star? Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, does it tell you, like, our ratings for this line? Oh, that's kind of cool. It just kind of gives you a general, like, oh, it's going to be more offensive. Or is this, like, after I mess with these? Oh, yeah, let me make sure I have these on use. Use, 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 use. So I kind of want them to shoot more. This one, this line is going to be a more of a shooting line too. I also want them to attack a little bit more, be a little bit more aggressive. I don't care too much about the back checking. Like just leave that in the middle. Pressure, I like to have the pressure up a little bit. Hitting, I mean these guys, none of these guys are really the greatest hitters. So we'll just leave that in the middle. Tempo, we'll have a higher tempo. And yeah, passing will just be average. Uh, the third line, though. Like, Philippa, he's two way. So he could be, like, more defensive. It says our defense is only two. So I guess probably because they're, like, lower ranked players. 
They got some decent. They're not tough at all. Is our fourth line tough at all? All right, cool. This fourth line, I just want them to like hit a little bit more. They can be intense as fuck if they want to be. I guess we'll put a little bit on the back. Nah, I don't know. If, uh, month. Yeah, when they're coming back. Yeah, I want that up too. They don't really have to attack too much. Like, is this attacking for like when they have the puck? Offensive behavior of player. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I don't really care if they fourth line is really attacking. Pressure. Fucking intense as hell. Tempo. They're gonna play it like they're not getting as much line time, so they can play at this higher, higher speed. Yeah, I don't know if I want it super high though, because they're not as skilled. If they're trying to take up the puck up, they are fast though. Let's just have it like right there. And they'll just shoot a shit ton because we're just going to do it like that. I'm not going to mess with this too much. There's just too much to mess with right now, and I don't really know too much about it. I guess we can mess. Can we mess with. Oh, this is just the entire line. Okay. Yeah, so. And then they got like player ones. I was kind of messing with those, but like you can't mess with them like on here. Unless you just put it up there. I don't know. Like I to mess with it, this, I've just been going to the lines. And then like say I want to mess with the Kaisers. I go there. Oh, whoops. I'm not there. I would go to like click on their roll. And then, so I already messed with all their rolls. And then I just like adjusted these. I did like I think I did the forwards. I don't think I I think I did a few of the defensemen like prone. Yeah, I did like kind of the defensemen that I actually care more about. Like if they're like two way defensemen, I kind of just like left them like just in the middle because I'm like they can just do whatever. They're doing both. And yeah, so here's my five on five. We got that uh, power play. I got pretty much the same for the top lines. I think I. Is Hiroshi on a third line? Yeah. So I got Hiroshi on the power play because I'm not going to put, N was it Nielsen? I think I took Nielsen off. Yeah, I, I put FNCU at center because he can play center. And I just swapped out Nielsen with Hiroshi because I'd rather have some player, a player that can grow than a player that's like 35 or 36 that's going to be leaving the league soon. I tried, I put Cho Cholowski down here. Get him some more ice time. I changed the ice time a little bit. It used to be like 75 25 for all these. I tried to keep it a little bit balanced, but I want that top line out there the most time. <coughs> Penny to kill. Glenny obviously is going to be on the top for all those. Nielsen, he is a pretty good penalty killer, so I thought I'd throw him there. Put Helm, Ernie, and I just put Fabry right there just because I didn't know what to do with him. So. Yeah, and I just got more of my defensive guys. Kronik, he's just going to be on top for, like, everything. Same with the Kaiser. They're, like, our only, like, two decent. I guess Green's pretty decent, but, like, he's offensive. So I just put him on the bottom one. Trying to get Chalowski kind of just, like, middle of the pack for ice time on defensemen. Uh, so four on four and three on three. We got Larkin, Mantha. Wait. Oh, this is four on four. Larkin, Mantha, the Kaiser, Kronik. Double A, Burt, Chalowski, and Green, Larkin, Mantha, Ronick, Athanasiu, Burt, Green, and then Goalie. Like this, I kind of, I didn't, yeah, I didn't want the A to change. I, I'm like, yeah, so I think it's out of four. Yeah. So, yeah, two, kind of just like start the hottest goalie. Best rated, I put it at two because they're both about the same. So I figure I just kind of have it in the middle. Uh,. Backup start frequency, I put it two. Kind of just split it between them. I think, yeah, he's... Howard's, like, a full bit better. I think I'll put this at one, actually. He's a full star better, or whatever, ABI, ability. One full ability better. <laughs> I don't know how to, like... I feel like the rating's kind of weird in this, but it makes sense, at least. Uh... So yeah, that's like my lineup and all that. So I offered those trades. I think, I think we can just go and start it up and hit continue.
I wonder how long it's going to take. I have all the all the leagues like oh, okay. Oh, look, they already got better from like the one day or is this just because we're still technically like in preseason training camp? So like, I wonder if those trades like went, but training camp development for it. Double A. He got his bravery up. Like okay professional so like they can still grow i wonder if like he'll go past a three star if like i keep growing him like this and i wonder how long until like they won't get any more stats like if if you keep trying to train them if they won't get any more stats why is bowie growing oh, i guess maybe just generally i don't think i had anything on bowie team player went up ernie aggression went up oh mantha got two he got aggression and professionalism Carlini got aggression. Larkin got professionalism. Oh, I wonder if I go to. Let's go to Grand Rapids and see if they got. So they don't have one for Grand Rapids. Maybe I'm just not. Like, it's too early in the season for them to get. I don't know. What about Toledo? So this doesn't change at all. It just has all messes. Okay. Let's go back to Red Wings. So did, did those trades like do anything? Did they go through? Did I mean, I guess like on like the news on the home, this should tell you like about trades and all that, like transactions. So yeah, nothing. So I wonder if they're like still like brewing about it, I guess. I don't know. Like if my trades like were actually offered because it just like went back to the home screen. I feel like it should say like, oh, your trade was offered or. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong with it, but where is my game right here? Play. Not enough goalies to create lineup for Detroit Red Wings. What? I have two goalies. Red Wings. Is one of them injured? Oh, whoops. I have to go to like my roster. Oops. Death chart? No. Lines. I got two. Go like, am I supposed to have a third one? That doesn't make sense. Like, I don't get it. Do I have to check these? Like, these are my goalies. <laughs> these are my shootout spots. I don't get it. Uh, here's my extra attackers. What's, like, what does this do? These checks. Is that, like, locking them there? Let me just check all these boxes. I don't fucking know. 12 forwards. Oh, did I not dress them yet? Is that, like, the... Th Hold on. Uh, lines. So, like, do I have to dress them? Shot player, the Grand Rapids. <sighs> dress player. He's. I don't get it. What's happening? Oh, okay. So, it. Does that work then? <laughs> Can I play? Um, NHL schedule play. Not enough skate. So I have to do that with the skaters too, don't I? Ugh. That's so stupid. Well, I guess if I want to scratch some, it makes sense. So like. I have to dress all these players, though. Dress. <laughs> Can I... Why aren't they just set to dress? And then I undress... Like, I scratch the ones I don't... Undress the ones I... <laughs> scratch the ones I don't want. Um, I would be... Yay! 20 players are dressed. I did... Oh, wait. I have too many. All right. Who did I get that I wasn't supposed to? I guess I can only dress one goalie at a time. No, they should both be dressed. I don't get it. 3, 6, 9, 12. 3, 4, 6. Yeah. Alright, who did I do that I wasn't supposed to? Can I sort by this? Is, oh wait, Biega, he's not playing. That's who it was. Got him scratched also. All right, back to. There you go, you little scamp. 
Oh, do I have to check these off then? Like, what happens if I check this? What? Oh, this is just showing where they're at. Oh, okay. That's kind of neat. Well, I guess I want to mess with my Grand Rapids one then real quick. It's just dress um, by... I wish I could sort by potential. But yeah, back to the Red Wings. Looks like we got our shit figured out. Make sure I have these people... Okay, no, that'd be just dressing them. Huh. So, Zetterberg, you're not going to be captain anymore. You're losing that because you're pretty much retired. So, we're not going to have a captain yet, though. I do like... Let's see how the season goes. I will... Yeah, Larkin's an A. Uh, we'll give one to... I guess we give one to DeKaiser. he's been with us for a while and then the other one I know Nielsen has one but I kind of want to give it to Bertuzzi let's give it to Glennie he'll be alternate one Kaiser will be alternate two I like that alright so should be good now <laughs> after like eight years of trying to figure that out let's just play let's see do I do anything in these games now so is the game going on right now that's my lineup yeah we're going to continue let's just see what happens scratch players head to head okay play a game I wonder how long this takes to just sim it like in real time gins. Play by play speed. We're gonna go very fast. Clock speed. Well actually let's just do clock speed. Yeah, normal. I want I think it's on full right now, so let's just do like average sound. Yeah. Let's mute that. I did not like the sound. <laughs> and yeah, okay. Play. Okay, that didn't change like anything. Hey, we're getting some shots on goal though. Let's go back to options. <laughs> play by play speed. Oh, okay, so the play by play is going very fast. Now the clock speed, I want that to go at least. Let's go very fast. And then this, yeah. Both just done very fast. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Tripping. Oh, we're on the power play. Okay. So lines. Oops. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> play. I don't know why it stopped. We gonna get a goal off this power play? Come on. No? Damn, we are out shooting them. I mean, it's preseason. They're probably playing like they're rookies. Well, we got like our, our starting lineup in. Can I look at their lines? Uh, change team. Huh, I don't know. They could be playing. Yeah, I don't know. So we're in the second period. Ah, DeKaiser, I gave you the A. Why are you fucking <laughs> taking a penalty, man? We are out shooting them like crazy, though. Let's see if we can penalty kill. Do they... No. Why is the... Oh. I wonder what all that jazz is about. So we're just going to continue. Uh, manage. Let's continue. <laughs> See what we get. So yeah, I don't know how long these loading screens are, 
are going to take, especially like off season, they're going to be trying to simulate all those leagues because I have them all on. Uh, your cap is going to change from 89 to 81. If your payroll is above 81.5, you'll need to lower it by October 2nd. Oh, they, okay, so they do. Okay. I wanted to give them Bernier and get a fourth. They said no. So it just takes like a little bit of time. That's kind of cool. So I'm, I got a few trades that'll be coming in then. Well, at least like the news of them. Oh, I wonder if I have to go back to training again and like do th okay no I don't so it just stays and then it'll tell me as like I go on that's cool all right home uh let's look at the so I guess that's standings for like it's not gonna show you for preseason uh let's go to schedule actually let's just stay on where did it give me? Was it just on news? It told me that. Yeah, let's stay in here. Uh, play game. Just continue. Sim game. Probably gonna lose. Yeah, two to three. Cool. Continue. Continue. I just want to continue until I get these trades. Uh, find out if they accepted or declined them. And then I can see about the whole cap issue because I think I might have a cap issue if if uh, if they do take that. Uh, was it Dougie Hamilton? I think I'm not sure, but oh, I got some. Ooh, they did. Oh, so Caroline accepted. Stop. They didn't, so yeah, Arizona does not like me. I think I offered Caskey for Comrie. I guess Caskey, I mean, they said, like, it might go through. But I got, <laughs> I got Dougie Hamilton. I honestly was not expecting to get him, but they said it would probably go through. He thought he was ripping me. I mean, I'm getting Dougie Hamilton. I don't think that's a ripoff. He was Bowie in a second rounder. Like, I'm getting... I mean, I honestly probably shouldn't have done that. I didn't need my draft picks. But I gave him Washington's second rounder, so I still have mine. So, now I kind of want to mess with my lines. So, now, Bowie... I, I traded him, and he's showing up there still. Do I have to go through another day? Do I have... Um... <laughs> A little confused. News. Oh, complete trade. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna complete it. 